Um, we are doing a team builder thing for um, our mini UCL that takes place on Pokemon Showdown. And uh, our opponent is Elliot from the Wishy Washy. <laughs> What we're talking about, ne never mind. You know what? This, this is the teams that we have. Well, this is 12 Pokemon that we have. Uh, left side's my team. My right side's the opponent's team. And, uh, boom. And, uh, so... We're gonna, like, talk about, like, the things. First of all, uh, I... I made this thing. Well, I did this tournament thing I made it's called it's called mini UCL it's like mini United Champion League the, our opponent is Elliot of course Sh not Galactic Elliot just a friend Elliot shout out to Galactic Elliot and uh, anyways so uh so this <laughs> let's see so he has Elliot has a Dragonite that thing really goes really well. I tried to record this before, by the way. And, um, it didn't work too well. Oh my god. Oh, sorry. Sorry for the silence. So, Dragonite's really good against some of my teams, like Garchomp and High Dragon. And, uh, some of, like, Gallade as well, I guess. Because, like, you know, it's like Dragon type and Flying type. Uh, my Red Jacks and, uh, <laughs> Sylveon and Togekiss can take it on pretty decently. And, uh, what else? Oh, yeah, we have Jolteon too, so this thing could run like Thunderbolt, uh, Volt Switch, a Hidden Power, like Ice or something. I don't know. Don't ask me. So, this thing can be scary. Um, the only thing that really takes it on is like Pokekiss. So, I guess you could say, um, hold on. Is this better? That's probably better. It's probably better. It takes on my Togekiss and Crobo. Um, plus, because of the fact it has, like, hidden power ice, it can take on uh, Garchomp and stuff. What else? Plus, uh, okay, so let's see. Okay, so Lapras, it could, it could run through my team with Ice Beam and stuff. But as long as I bring something good, it should be fine. And, uh, oh, by the way, we're limited to like one Uber. So I brought Xerneas. He brought this thing has a history. <laughs> it literally does. If it runs like Power Up Punch, it could run through our team. Literally, if it runs like Earthquake and Crunch, this thing is right. So best thing I could think of is either using the blade or make a Gallade. And uh oh by the way it's where we're using Rotom Wash. Uh so his Rotom Wash uh is a good like thing against his my crocodile. And I can't even send in crocodile on this thing anyways because it's Uh, yeah, so it's a Breloom. Regis can take it on, but then again, it's like, has terrible weapons. Well, it's not bad, it's just... The, this thing cannot stay in on a... Robat and Togekiss. Magnezone, I don't see it as a threat, but... If we like it carried away, then maybe it could. Uh, I don't know. It could. It it could run like. No, I can't do that. I can't do that. See, 
has like so it could counter my crowbat. I could easily take it out with like drain punch, a close combat or something from uh, Mega Gallade. The what else? What else? He has a crowbat of his own, and uh, and uh, he could run it against my Gallade and uh, Sylveon and. Gengar, ooh, hi Nappy, uh, Gengar, because we're doing Gen 6, it's going Levitate, so we can't use Garchomp and Crocodile against it, unless we want to, like, send it out a crunch, so, anyways, anyways, uh, we can't use Sylveon, because it's Poison type, plus it could, like, go with Bomb or something, and Dewblade could struggle, like, badly against it, because, yeah, <laughs> It also has Aerodactyl. This thing kind of runs through my team because it has like Iron Head, like Rock Slide, Stone Edge, and uh, Aerial Ace. So Earthquake takes out like the Blade, uh, uh, some of <laughs> Ferrothorn. Uh, Iron Head takes out. Uh, Togekiss and Regis. Earthquake, it it just runs through. So the blade, so lol. And then Rock Slide. Yeah, Crobat and Togekiss. Okay, so I have a common weakness to Rock apparently. Um, Gudra, I'm assuming it because it's gonna rise its leg. Especially, it's probably gonna hold like a an assault vest or something. So, I guess a good physical, like, outrage from Garchomp could be good, like, against it. And then finally, he has another Mega. He, what's interesting about Elliot, he chose two Megas for this one, which is, like, Mega Kangaskhan and Mega Gallade. I only chose one, because why not? He chose Mega Gallade and Mega Kangaskhan. So, back to the topic at hand. He has Mega Gallade. He could, like, set up Sword Stance and, like, run through the team. Unless I I build up with a pixelate uh, hyper voice from Sylveon, and if I predict the drain punch then or close combat I could go into the blade, or Togekiss for that matter, or Crobat. So let's see what can what would be like switch options. So if I would be facing like like with my crocodile, what happened? So if you would want to switch out. He would want to go to like something that he would like take it easily. I would go for like Stone Edge on the Aerodactyl, Dragonite Switch, or Crobat. And uh, uh, who can take on Gengar? Uh, Crocodile. Holy gosh, this thing, this thing rocks. <laughs> oh, I could also set up. Speaking of rocks, I could also set up Stealth Rocks, like, and. Arathorn. Uh, Rotom, I'm not sure how well it's going to, like, go against, like, these mods. Uh, except for, like, Aerodactyl and Crobat. And then, then Gudra, it has good special, special bulk, but it's, like, not that great on that, so. I guess something like Earthquake on from, from Garchomp should work. Uh, and Sword Stance Iron Head. Oh, we could also run like Sacred Sword on on Dublade to take on the Mega Lapras. It's not bad, and the Magnezone. Ooh, and then Togekiss deals with the Breloom. and I guess. I don't know. We'll see on the the match. We'll see on the match. We'll see on the match, which is taking place today later this afternoon but i'm gonna be playing some oa emerald but i need to focus on the the competition all right okay so that's gonna be it for me guys that's gonna be it for me all right so so this is the team builder uh like how well i don't know how well i'm gonna do it's the first time i'm doing like something like this like um, 
this. We have like damage calculators up, so it's good. And uh, yeah. that's gonna be from me, guys. Uh, leave a like if you if. But if you do subscribe, it really helps out my channel, and I'm gonna get the heck out of here, and I'll see you next time. Peace.